Oh god, that's not good. Hey guys, it's Vostop, and today you're going to be seeing how much faster an SSD actually is. So, I got the M.2 SSD 500GB right here, and let's get into this. So, now I'm going to be trying to install Windows on this. It's probably going to be a tedious process as I haven't installed Windows on an M.2 yet. It should be the same way, but let's try this. not letting me boot off my M.2. Yeah, finally. Okay. But my M.2 is right there. Okay, so I did put it in the right way. I'm gonna leave this out. I'm just gonna leave this right here, sitting on my desk. I'm going to plug in my computer. I'm going to power it on. I have my CD drive plugged in. Now I'm going to boot off the CD. Well, you know, I'm just gonna reset everything on on this at least. We have the M.2 SSD on the left and the mechanical hard drive on the right. So just turning the computer on only took the SSD 11 seconds and the hard drive finished 50 seconds later with a time of one minute and one second. For the next test, I'm going to log in and stop the stopwatch when the drives aren't under load anymore. The SSD comes in at 43 seconds and the hard drive is still going after 2 minutes. So it finally finished with 2 minutes and 53 seconds. Now moving on to the games. The first game is Battlefield 4. The SSD finishes in 32 seconds and the hard drive isn't that far behind at 47 seconds. Battlefield Hardline is our next game and holy crap the SSD is fast at only 17 seconds. The hard drive finishes 21 seconds later, at 41 seconds total. So the last game seems to be everyone's favorite, GTA V. The SSD struggles a little at roughly 26 seconds, and the hard drive again, not lacking that far behind, at 48 seconds. So what have we learned here? Well, actually nothing. We all know an M.2 SSD is faster, and will always beat a hard drive, but you came here to know how much faster. Well, the M.2 SSD beat the hard drive on an average of 48 seconds. If you have an SSD though, there are some good things and bad things. The good thing is, it's fast, small, and there's no moving parts. The bad is, it's a lot more money per gigabyte. The mechanical hard drive is around 5 cents per gigabyte, and the SSD is around 22 cents per gigabyte. So that about wraps it up for this video. As you can see, the M.2 SSD is way faster than the hard drive that I originally had, and it makes the load times on the games way faster. So if you guys like this video, please like, subscribe, maybe share, and See you in the next one.